a little better, but I uh, I had a pretty hard time with the long sword and then gun lance when I started. <laughs> I need to play around with Lawn Sword in World. Well, hey, we're live. <laughs> Hi, everyone. We're talking about Monster Hunter. <laughs> Let me just oh, so we're doing the Monster Arena today. No, Feels we're not. <laughs> we're not that far yet. We also have special guest Tony Danza. Yes, welcome, Tony Danza. Who's the owl boss now? I hesitated for a moment because I just remembered that show was called Who's the Boss, not Who's the Boss Now. That would be a good title if they re well they can't reboot it, but I never watched Who's the Boss. I thought I'd seen it and then I yeah, that's true. I guess I meant like revive it, like that thing they're doing now where instead of rebooting Don't shows, they just make new seasons set too. decades later. We're leaving once Yuna gets here. So how is Fuller House? No matter how dark the night, more uh, But yeah, I was comes. thinking that I'd seen uh, our journey Who's the Boss, anew. but actually, I was thinking of Three's Company. <laughs> Get ready for the journey ahead. So I completely forgot where we were. Uh, we just got, um, it's Yon, who, uh, because Talon won that particular drive, uh, we named Thorse. <laughs> That's a good name. So, uh, donations are now open for Shiva. And they will be for quite some time. <laughs> Did Twitch get rid of bits? You can get bit, uh, getting bits by ads. They may have for you. But uh, rid of something for me that they never added to begin with. You can't yeah, give Europe bits for ads. That would make them bankrupt. Maybe you have it now. I know Yuna's in there, but I need to get this chest first. Alright, cool. Now I got an ether. She was working until dawn. Healing the wounded. Sending the fallen. Okay. I guess I'll just... let her sleep for now, then. <sighs> Ah. Morning. You know what? That morning? must suck to sleep in that room. Don't worry. <laughs> but it's morning. <sighs> I'm so sorry. I'll get ready right away. Just a moment. <sighs> Don't worry. It's okay. <laughs> Oh, sleepy head. Sorry, I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Really, there's no rush here. Your hair. Around the bedroom is funny. A summoner with bad hair. What's the world coming to? Could be. You could have woken me up. Uh, we called to you, but with all that snoring. Uh, oh. Mmm. What is it today? Everyone's picking on me. <laughs> oh, you too, Sir Orin? Once Lady Yuna fixes her hair, we leave. <laughs> uh, 
I hadn't really laughed like that in a long time. It was only later that I realized. The only one really laughing then was me. Laughing must have been the only thing keeping them going. Can I go back in to get that chest that was in the room you was in? Okay, so because that cutscene is right there, I've done zero grinding. <laughs> it's just this collection of people doing animations at each other. Off so early? Lady Yuna, you must be exhausted after working so hard last night. Will you be okay? With the not Moomba's <laughs> following you. I feel that I have rested enough, but thank you for your kindness. Will you be leaving too? Yes. First we cross the moon flow, and then we head north in search of chocobos to replace those we have lost. Once we find chocobos, our mounted forces will ride again. Huh? Aren't you missing someone? Captain! Chocobo, wait for please me! please get out of her face. What took you so long? We're you know, leaving. You see uh... <laughs> You I'm expect me to keep up with a chocobo? I can't hear if I died. Lady Yuna, I wish you good fortune. Did people already die or...? Elma? A whole Let's bunch go. of people Let's died go. last time. Ma'am. Hey, can I, I just rest a sec? Before or after no complaints. It was before it's young. Like, we fight Sinspond, we, and then uh, a whole bunch of people die, then we walk 30 feet down the road into Itzion. Where to next? <laughs> we cross the moon flow. Gotcha. Oh, hey, guess moon what we did to do this episode? We get to rise, issue puff. That means we also get. Also, just a note. Just a note, shoe puff is less than eight letters. <laughs> oh yeah, I think I was saying, Lucille's uh, pants, despite it having her ass totally out, it's probably pretty nice if you're riding a choker bow. Well, anyway. <laughs> Listen, I just want people to know that uh, chocobo feathers just on your bare ass just feel really nice, okay? Is that from experience, Sid? Yes. Okay. From the very real chocobos. This random encounter enemy looks exactly like a boss. Was this a boss? This was a boss. I'm pretty sure it was. Like, uh, okay. back, back in Killica, we encountered an Ochi right. on the road. Summoner Yuna, ready. I guess that's a, that's a big difference from older Final Fantasies, that when they reuse bosses, it looks really weird. Because so of the scale like, difference. It looks like a sheet of blue. Cause like in classic ones, they were just like still art, so they just looked really different anyway. They weren't like to scale. Yeah, I need to summon Nacho and have him just do this fight. Shoot pops way. Shoot pops way, dude. Excuse me. If its full name is Nacho Dorito, thank you. 
you haven't we had uh, only eight characters, so that's only in your fan on miss. Will you Listen, help us? Product branding. Be improved a lot though if uh, whenever Nacho attacked with a fire attack, he said, Feel the heat. So it burns to the ground! <laughs> he also bleeds Mountain Dew. You were coming up with some. You were coming up with some fucking. things. I'm trying to get sponsorship real hard. I'm trying, okay? I would love his sponsorship because I already get re-energized with Mountain Dew Gamer Fuel. Absolutely not. Not allowed on this channel. <laughs> I love re-energizing with zesty orange diet coke and burning my inside. Is that, is that a thing that happens? I don't know what they put in it, but like, it was very unpleasant to drink. Like, it's not just orange soda. Like, it burned really bad. And then when I poured the rest down in my drinks, I didn't want to finish it. Which, it's a tiny can of soda. Like, normally I'm just like, whatever, I'll finish it. Nope, didn't want to finish this. It fizzed like when I poured all the mouthwash down the drain. It cleaned my drain up. Yeah, leave the drain is out for you. Alright, so like, I haven't really talked about the differences between the expert sphere grid versus the normal sphere grid. Basically, the expert sphere grid is a lot more open. Uh, whereas, when you look at the, uh, when you look at how the normal ass sphere grid plays out, by comparison, it's basically a straight line. Mm. Yeah, I think I remember in Dexalon you can almost immediately cut. Tita's go down Orin's path? Yeah, well, I mean, every, like, in the, uh, let me zoom out a little bit. If I can remember how to fucking do that. <laughs> Hold on a second. There we go. Okay, so, by, by the way, that was the touchpad. Very intuitive. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so, like, you just see, like, people are way all over the place. Like, like Lulu's way the fuck down here. Like, Yuna and Kamari are close there, but Kamari starts in the dead center of the sphere grid, so it made sense for him to be close. This is a lot, right? possible to fill up the whole speed grid? Yeah, definitely. It yeah. just takes a lot of grinding. <laughs> yeah, grind, but then all your characters are like gods. busted, busted, overpowered. But like, um, uh, so like in the expert speed grid, everyone starts in the middle, like Kamari does. And there's fewer lots, but there's also fewer nodes, so you don't get quite as powerful. Uh, but like. <laughs> 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 Oh, even I got that reference. Alright, um, but like the main thing is like when you when you get like you can get go, go, really go. busted stuff really early with the expert sphere grid. But the thing about Mount Clay is that you also have a chance of fucking dying horribly, so I guess that's the plot of <laughs> And you're gonna need all those busted stats if you Go do Dark Eons and the Hidden Super Boss. Yeah, you can make it work with the normal Spear Grid too, I mean it's... And you can beat any challenge in this game, except I think one enemy would be uh, Zamato. Yeah, but that requires grinding flowers so you can find enough money at them. Yeah, and then you quick save and you, you, you load your game, you save and load and 
do just a chunk of the game, then you pay some money. Listen, strategy is for people who aren't rich. <laughs> it's like it's an analog for real life. <laughs> <laughs> Even in Death Universe Spira, we aren't safe from capitalism. We already met Owaka. <laughs> It's like uh, using the the charge weapons in Fantasy Star Online. The more money you got, the more damage you do. I forgot this was a thing in Fantasy Star One. You yeah, know, it's like you drain your HP and your MP or your. And this is why until such a time that Yuna learns all of Lulu's spells, Lulu is going to be like our MVP for like pretty much <laughs> all of the game. Uh, but as soon as Yuna learns them, she, Lulu, she falls off very hard. Yeah, Lulu hits the bench at some point. Also, like I, I don't know if I brought it up. Uh, way back when, when I was first starting out, uh, Kamari actually starts directly next to Ultima. <laughs> 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 well, not directly next to it. There's a bunch of like level four lots in the way that so that you can't do it immediately. But you could, in theory, just wait until you have all those level four lock spheres and then. Give him Ultima, but then he's extremely underpowered. Yeah, and there's one fight where you can only use Kamari. Oops. Oh, I wish she was more useful than he actually is. He is with the expert sphere grid. <laughs> yeah. I guess, yeah. Since you can just send him down some other path. Yeah. But I think I mean... you can send him down like. Immediately down Riku's path way before you get there. <laughs> Look! One of Kimari's friends! Looks just so like far, Kimari is the character I think what? in all these like Final Fantasy Fridays Both streams who has all stuck four. closest to the popular like, perception I've heard about it. Hornless! Hornless! <laughs> Listen to this fantastic voice acting. You come to insult Kimari? Wrong. We come to warn little Kamari. Summoners disappear. <laughs> Never return. Next will be Kimari's summoner. Poor Kimari. Lost his horn. Next lose his summoner. Pitiful Kimari. Howl alone. Howl alone. Yeah, Kingdom Hearts 3 actually looks kind of <laughs> good. Do those two uh, got something against looks you? Looks good. The story is about what I expected from the series at this point. What? The they story is you just start drinking to understand Kimari it. Kimari would deal with them. And I'll help. Kimari alone. But, uh... It's Kimari's problem. You can't interfere. It's a rule. I'm worried. Titus is not an after school special. Let the Ronso deal with Ronso problems, yeah? God, watch out. That's how it's always been. I mean, I'm worried about those summoners disappearing. Well, you cannot interfere with Ronso. It's just in air. It's taboo. Hey, if we guardians do our job, no problem, right? Cool. Confident. Yeah. I really do like the music for, uh,. Mount Dodge is that though that was just playing there. God, every fucking four feet's an Ochu! No wonder people don't travel anymore. I 
Magna Gessica Dwan? Fuck that, there was a lot. <laughs> Just wall to wall full shoes. So, do you still need to swap everyone out in this version to give them yes. experience? Yes, oh. you do. Let's see. technically a twin odyssey hasn't but it gives you an indicator oh yeah like i don't think necessarily that random encounters are bad it's just that uh when the encounter rates are not tuned properly then they are yeah and it also depends on what the encounters are like i don't mind then Encounters that require some thought, but I also don't want either just the counters where I mash the attack button or where I have to think like five turns in advance of what to do. <laughs> Are you saying you don't like to think five Stratego moves ahead? <laughs> Speaking of which, that Historia game is pretty good. Radiant Historia is pretty good, it's just that it takes a long time to get going. I already got two bad endings. Oh god, <laughs> I forgot how bad Lula's victory animation is. You mean the TNA pose? Oh, uh, pretty much entirely T. Yeah, there's not very much A in there. TNT. So do you think Titus' sword is, like, hard or soft? It's probably hard, so uh, it can actually hit things. Um... <laughs> maybe, wait, 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 can we consider that fucking phrasing? Wait. Depends on the mood. No, I'm thinking if, like, one of those wand toys you guys you could get as a kid. You guys never got those? The squishy things with the glitter in them? Yeah, I don't know what to tell you about. Because that reminds me of. talked anymore about Titus' sword, I'm gonna start banning people. <laughs> Am I only one to play it when we had those stupid toys? We know what you're talking about, Grassland. <laughs> Second grace period because of the fucking. Think of it as training. Yeah, shit, I'm gonna get some water. 
But of course, there's another fucking Ochu, so really what I should do is I sh the Now I should fucking run. <laughs> Uh, you just magic. So she heals for more. AKA the white mage. On with we meet again. On here. I heard you took part in Operation Mehen. You've seen that Machina aren't the answer. In the end, only summoners can hope to defeat Sin. You are right. I must train harder. I can help with that, if you like. I propose a contest of aeons. A friendly contest, of course. I'm ready. That's the so spirit. Do care here but before works. we begin... I don't know. I have healed Back your you see. Well, shall we? She summons Itzion, so we cannot summon Itzion. <laughs> That cool new summon you just got. Of course not. Call whichever Aeon you want. <laughs> Call whatever Aeon you want besides Thor's. I say fine, USD. I think effort will be the better choice here. I don't know. Don't hold anything back. Show me what you've learned. So the thing is, like, what happens if I cast fire on myself? You heal yourself? Yes. I'm show you do. Oh, hey. Also, it's fucking overdrive time, so first things first. Though I am going to cast fire on myself again just to heal up. Or 
well, fine. I guess I'll have to do it a third time. If it sucks seeing Titan's job. This one just needs to relax. This will be the deciding hit. If this doesn't kill it, then we lose. <laughs> Get it done. But I think uh, it's the doesn't use haste until it's at like a third of its health, so I'm pretty sure we're gonna win. You just killed, I guess, to the button lady. Oh, what was her name again? Before that, though, all good. There's like a lot right. of main side characters in this game that like show up once or twice and then like go by and done. So like, win or lose, you get the Summoner Soul, which lets you uh, teach Aeon's new abilities. And you have to have certain items to make uh, to teach them abilities. To meeting you again. Till next time, Yuna. So let's see what we can teach our fucking aeons. That's hoping you take a step and get with that. <laughs>
Hey, check that out. It's an Ochu. <laughs> I won't go so easy on you next time. The thing is, is like there's not say any like any say spheres for a while. Fucking a game. Should you let up? I'll be right back. This is the moon flow. These are moon lilies. They say that clouds of pyreflies gather here when night falls. The entire river glows like a sea of stars. Really? Hey, I got an idea! We're not waiting till nightfall. Nah. Hmm. Then, once we beat Sin, we're coming back. Hey, we better hurry or we'll miss the shoe puff. Shoe puff? That's some kind of boat? Hmm. Also, I think we're about to get into a boss fight. Don't they have to, like, just take the shoot puff the? or something? This is a shoe puff. Whoa! Uh, let's ride! Come on, let's go! All right, we board soon as we ready, huh? Oh, Walker, at your service. <laughs> Shufas kind of remind me of those, uh, what were they called in Morrowind? Soul Striders? Yeah. Scoop up Yuna with long nose. Yuna jump in three more times for fun. Kimari worried. Whoops. Yuna had fun. Kimari happy.
ten years ago. Ah, a history lesson? Jack saw his first shoe puff here. Surprised, he drew his blade and struck it. Wh why He was drunk. Thought it was a fiend. Oh, brother. We offered all the money we had as an apology. Jack never drank again. But it would seem that shoe puff still works here. <laughs> no, what the fuck, I don't Jack? think so. It's bad idea, yes. Please, we beg of you. Impossible! Impossible! What's wrong? <laughs> this guy won't let our chocobo on the shoe puff. Oh my God. Ah. It is kind of big. It's just not fair. Uh, he does have a point, though. So what? We just leave him behind? Hey, I didn't say that. Just... <sighs> it is no good. We will have to find another way. We will find a ford where we can cross on foot. Yes, Captain Sir. But... That'll take days. Where there's a will, there's a way. Oh, boy. That's our captain. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Where there's a will, there's a way. Those words stayed with me. I wonder how Captain Lucille is doing. Riding a shoe puff isn't that much fun. How little you know. Some things little boys never grow out of. Right? Is the same? Wasn't so bad. I can play a bit oh. with Paul. No. Would you like to hear a bit about the wondrous Why else we get Walker's ultimate weapon? You don't. Very well. There are many things we do not know about the shoe puff. For example, what does it eat? It eats nothing. The water it sucks through its schnoz somehow supports its considerable size. Some theorize it eats teeny weeny waterborne organisms. Hmm. And that, as they say, is that. Okay, I think there's a primer here. It might be the other wharf. Rides the shoe puff. All aboard. Shoe puff launching. Boss being a pain in the ass. Hey. Huh? Take a look. What? A shoe puff is not even moving. Real Whoa. pain in the shoe puff. A sunken city. A machina city, a thousand years old. They built the city on top of bridges across a river. But the weight of the city caused the bridges to collapse, and it all sank to the bottom. Right. It's a good lesson. A lesson? Yeah. Why build a city over a river, yeah? Uh, well, it would be convenient with all that water there. Nope, that's not why. 
They just wanted to prove they could defy the laws of nature. Hmm? I'm not so sure about that. Yevon has taught us. When humans have power, they seek to use it. If you don't stop them, they go too far, yeah? Waka, Shut you're... up, Waka. Waka got me existed to fly as Yeah, nature. but don't you use Machina too? Like the stadium and stuff, right? Yevon, it decides which Machina we may use and which we may not. But so uh, what kind of Machina may Yevon we not also use has then? Power. Doesn't that mean Remember they would also have to Mihen? use it? That kind. Or war will rage again. War? More than a thousand years ago, mankind waged war using Machina to kill. They kept building more and more powerful Machina. They made weapons so powerful, it was thought they could destroy the entire world. The people feared that Spira would be destroyed. But the war did not stop. Wh what happened then? Sin came, and it destroyed the cities and their Machina. The war ended, and our reward was Sin. So, Sin's our punishment for letting things get out of hand, eh? Man, that's rough. Yeah, it is. But it's not like the Machina are bad. Only as bad as their users. It's because of people like the Albed screwing everything up. Me. Sit down. Sorry! Ah! The outfit! Alright, so here's the important thing. Luna, we'll save you! I only have access to Titus and Wanda. <laughs> So this is going to be uh, difficult. Can I use Hawker's status effects on it at least? It's like, vulnerable to lightning! It's like, yeah, let me just cast lightning. <laughs> it's immune to darkness. I feel like you don't have a problem constantly getting her ass kicked in. Captured. You know, you have your staff. Why can't you just summon one of your eons to get you out of there? Also, if you do keep walk off the boat, that's gonna be the bad thing because he can swim. He can swim his way to shore then. Oh, I learned uh, the 
charging method warrior, which means doing damage as opposed to taking damage. Bad. God, that was horrible with overdrives today. <laughs> Thanks, Waka. Now, oh, well, I win. Are you hurt? Uh, no, I'm fine. Oh, oh. Ah, those out bed. Oh god, what's going on with Yuna's hair? Okay? I'm sorry. Lose We're hair. all okay now. Yuna. And Lulu. Oh god. Someone help them. Damn the out bed. What do they want from us? Have something to do with Luca? What are they after Yuna for? Wait, they're mad they lost the tournament. Oh wait, they're mad about Operation Meehan. I wonder. Didn't Kamari's clansmen say something about summoners disappearing? Ah, so the out better behind that. Those sand plastic grease monkeys. Hey, Waka. It's no use complaining about the owl bed now, right? We'll protect Yuna from anyone, anywhere. It's that easy. That's all I need to know. Well, I guess so. You're right. Walker toned down the racism a little bit, Smidge. No. He's Walker, he doesn't know how to do that. It's his defining character trait. I feel like if he like I'm trying to remember that comic, it's the one with the bike. Looks like we're stuck here for a while. Might be more out bed. Keep watch, yeah? Kimari fail as guardian on Shupov. Kimari never fail again. This one, but change, change it over to walk his face and just put down Al Bed. Just only talk to Walker <laughs> in Al Bed now. You're not dead? 
back there. Ah! Riku! You're Riku! Uh, hey! Uh, you're okay! How you been? Terrible. Yeah, you don't look so good. What happened? You beat me up, remember? Huh? Oh! That Machina? That was you? You know, you big meanie. <sighs> w wait, but you attacked us. Nuh-uh, it's not exactly what you think. Yo! Friend of yours. Uh, and you could say that. Pleased to meet ya. I'm Riku. Yuna, Lulu, I told you about her, remember? She was the one who helped me before I was washed up on Besaid. She's an Albed. <sighs> wow, so you like all your life. What luck She's meeting here, yeah? Praise be to Yevon. So, uh, Riku, look a little so, like, beat up. You does okay? Waka know that Yuna's uh, half Albed? Huh? What? There's something we need to discuss. Oh, go ahead. Girls only. Boys, please wait over there. Right. Sorry, Waka. Huh? What? Ah. Sir Oren? I, don't like I at all. would like Riku to Christine. be my guardian. Show me your face. I like the fact that Riku's wearing like Look at me. fantasy oh, van okay. shoes. Open your eyes. Actually, not the boots. As I thought. Um, no good. Are you certain? Hundred percent. So, anyway, can I? If Yuna wishes it. Yes, I do. <laughs> Riku's a good girl. She helped me a bunch. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm for it. The more the merrier. Right oh. Then I'll just have to be the merriest. It was strange. Even though Waka had always hated the Albed. Riku, at your service. He never realized Riku was one of them. Also not good with his racism. Hey, so remember chemistry from Final Fantasy V? Yeah. <laughs> you is it still broken as fuck? Yup. That's why it's in oh. overdrive now. That's why it's still good to get a Donkey Mario really early. What did you just do? 
that can't get mixed was like great. Right. I can combine items and use them like this. Overdrive. It's not All that right. tough, really. But you can start stealing stuff from him early. I don't know. You know, Viku just has, like, a little mixing kit on her at all times. Man, she is extremely sassy. She's also, like, 12. No. <laughs> 16. Close enough. I mean, she's older than that, but, like... I think she's, like, 17. 16 or 17. Six, she's 16. I think she's the same age as Yuna. Those are our cousin. She's 15 in this game, 17 and 2. Oh no, I destroyed the treasure chest! Damn it. No, not the treasure. Rip. Oh, the treasure. Bug out. I think he was just having a mini scope. I had haste on him. Hey, it's an Ochu. Uh... <laughs> uh, not even here with Steel. I'll be right back. Steel. How the fuck did the Ochu get over here? Did it swim? I mean, yeah, also. <laughs> Also, hey, Riku's stats haven't got better since she uh, since we had her at the very beginning of the game. Yeah. Well, at least she will probably gain levels really fast then to make up for that. Are you guys ready for? Exposition? Not really, no. Well, too bad we're in water salon. Do we have to be? We have you been know expecting as well as I do. you, Lady We have Yuma. to. <laughs> Welcome to Guado Salam. This way, my On the bright side, we're about to get like the second best sword in the game for tedious. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, I beg your pardon. Oh, right. this is I am well, called Trommel Guado. I am in the direct service of our leader, Whatever the great Seymour called. Guado. Lord Seymour has very important business with Lady Yuna. Business with me? Whatever could it be, I wonder? Please, uh, come inside the manor. All will be explained. Of course, uh, your friends are also welcome. So is every Guado's last Star name Guado? Ah, I almost is it forgot. just Seymour in particular? I don't know. But yeah, also now we can take item. Like, you know how we've been doing weapons and stuff with empty slots? Uh, now we can customize them with items. It only took like 30 hours into the game to get that ability. Eh, it's not that long, it's like 10. I'm trying to think, like, this is like, what, the fifth stream? So maybe 15 hours? Yeah, that sounds... Better than I thought.
What would you do without me? Crap. Incidentally, that's also how you get a ton of money. Is there is a lady in Killerjo who sells weapons with nothing, like a bunch of empty slots and no skills. Nice. So you get them, you craft, uh, you turn them in, like you just put whatever skills you want on them and you sell them back for way more money. It's a good use of the item if you don't use them to power up your summons. I think, uh, I think also there's like a specific skill you put on them. like it turns a weapon that you buy for a thousand into a weapon you sell for sixty thousand. <laughs> There's a specific place I'm trying to find. Okay, it's this one. Alright, now we can go into the- we can go into the plot house. I wonder what smells so nice. Stay close to Yuna. Kimari not like Mr. Seymour. Uh, Why does he want to see me? These are the past leaders of the Guado. They all look the same. Mr. Seymour doesn't look like them, no. Don't you know? The last leader... Maester Jiskel wed a human woman. She was Seymour's mother. Oh. I don't like the smell of this one, eh? This way, please. Inform Lord Seymour. Please wait here. There's no temple Welcome here. Welcome to the Lord's worst shitty dinner party. Summoners usually just pass through on their way. Got some yeah. fruit. <laughs> got some more fruit. What? I didn't even ask a question, and you're explaining things. You'd rather I say nothing, then? No, no. Maybe you finally believe I don't know anything about Spira. And maybe that means you believe me about Xanarkin, too? Well, there are many things I do not know. Your Xanarkind is one of those things. I suppose I can't say what I think, either way. Still, be careful. You shouldn't tell other people. Yeah, I know. Mm, this is cool. I just realized that, too, that fruit is just one flat texture. <laughs> oh my god, it is. <laughs> You just see where some of the uh, where some of the sprites are trying to turn, so they're just sort of like angled. In here. It's bizarre. Gimari, speak no more. Stay on your guard. Why? 
This guy is just a priest, right? Those with power use that power. Maesters have power. Wait. You sure you don't have something against Yevon? <laughs> I lived a long time in Xanarkand. Ah. Oh. I get the feeling he called us up here for more than just dinner. again. Since Lord Jiskel passed away, these halls have been too quiet. The death of Lord Jiskel was a great loss for all of Spira. Was this Maester Jiskel really such a great guy? He brought the teachings of Yevon to the Guado. He was truly a great man. Truly a loss for us all. Now, a new leader, Lord Seymour, has come before us. Lord Seymour is the child of a guado and a human. He will be the tie that binds our two races together. But that is not all, I think. Lord Seymour, he will surely become the shining star that lights the way for all the peoples of Spira. That is enough, Trommel. Must I always endure such praise? Welcome! You wanted to see me? Please, make yourselves at home. There's no rush. Please keep this short. Yuna must rush. Pardon me. It has been a long time since I had guests. Lady Yuna, this way. This sphere is a reconstruction created from the thoughts of the dead that wander the far. Mm. Uh, uh, uh. Xanarkin? Correct. Xanarkin, as it looked 1,000 years ago. The great and wondrous Machina city, Xanarkand. She once lived in this metropolis. <laughs> she who? Lady Unaleska. She was the first person to defeat Sin and save the world from its ravages. And you have inherited her name. It was my father who named me. Lord Braska was entrusting you with a great task. He wanted you to face Sin as Lady Unaleska did. However, Lady Unaleska did not save the world alone to defeat the undefeatable Sin. It took an unbreakable bond of love, of the kind that binds two hearts for eternity.
Wow, your face is beet red. You okay? He... He asked me to marry him. You serious? Uh, hey! You know what Yuna must do. Of course. Lady Yuna. No, all summoners are charged with bringing peace to Spira. But this means more than just defeating sin. She must ease the suffering of all Spira. She must be a leader for the people. I proposed to Lady Yuna as a maester of Yevon. Spira is no playhouse. A moment's diversion may amuse an audience, but it changes nothing. Even so, the actors must play their parts. There's no need to answer right away. Please, think it over. We will do so then. We leave. Lady Yuna, I await your favorable reply. Why are you still here, sir? I beg your pardon. We Guado are keen to the scent of the far plane. Position? Because we're not. <laughs> we're never done with exposition. Yuna, the High Summoner's daughter. Seymour, the leader of the Guado. Married in the name of Yevon. Overcoming the barriers of race. It would give Spira something cheery to talk about for a change. I may actually just... Sounds just like I a may actually just cut it off like before we go to the next area. Come on, uh, let's just like, get on I mean, with we're the not going to uh, a place and I mean, get powered up and there's going to be some mm. plot, but like... Jealous? The yeah. next area is the Thunder Plane. No way. We oh, gotta no. defeat Sid. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> can wait. Huh. You sure picked a fine time to lay this one on us. Say no more. Maybe it is a fine time. You serious? If my getting married would help Spira, if it what would make people fate. happy, if I could do that for people, Maybe I should do what I can. I never imagined doing anything like this. But I won't answer till I know what's right. Seriously? You could always just quit your pilgrimage and get married. <laughs> I will. Go on. I'm sure that Lord Seymour will understand. Um, I guess so. I am a summoner. I must fight and defeat sin. Like Braska before you. I had to stop myself from shouting. What's there to think about? I'm going to the far plane. I'm going to see my father and think on this. Go on. We'll be right behind you. Mm. I wondered why none of the others ever asked Yuna. Do you love Seymour? Do you even like him? Far plane is not a metaphysical representation of heaven either. It's just a place you can go. <laughs> Question about this far plane. When somebody dies, like, hey, a summoner if you sends them to the someone, far plane, you'll right? Get an illusion of so them. their souls, or whatever they are, uh, they go to the far plane, right? But that's the far plane we're going to, right? And Yuna's old man's there too. Do dead people live there or something? Hmm. You thinking those funny thoughts again, yeah? <laughs> You'll see once we get there.
Aren't you coming? <sighs> I do not belong there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You're scared. Searching the past to find the future. This is all that is there. I need it not. You'd better be going. You're not really going to see the dead. More like your memories of them. People think of their relatives, and the Pyreflies react to them. They take on the form of the dead person. An illusion, nothing else. Hmm. Well, have fun. What? You're not going either, Riku? I keep my memories inside. Huh? Memories are nice, but that's all they are. What the? The far plane was cool, but I couldn't stop thinking about Yuna. Her parents, they looked so happy together. But it got me worried that maybe seeing them would make Yuna really consider Seymour's proposal. Yo, Chapu! Meant to come see you earlier, yeah? Sorry. I know you won't hold it against me. Eh, I gave up that game. I'm a guardian from here on, you know? This guy looks a lot like you. Showed up. Traveling with him, I thought maybe you were still alive somewhere, yeah? But then again, here you are on the far plane. Guess your place is here. So, how you been? Oh, that guy I just told you about. I gave him your sword. He likes it. Huh? Wow. Yeah, so now uh, Brotherhood is dope. Strength plus 15% sensor and water strike. Oh. He is dead, and I am still alive. Coming here really makes that clear. I should focus more on what I have to do now. <laughs> what? what? He's I'm dead. Not even sure what I'm saying. Don't you mean that you Let's should leave fall. Chapu behind? I'm sure he was a great guy, but don't be others. Hmm. That's a possibility. Hmm. How about mm, Waka? What, me? With Waka? Yeah, you two get along great. Getting along isn't enough, not even close. Oh, sorry, my mistake. You'd do well to remember Just imagine that. I'm layering the fucking Knowing curb your enthusiasm women, thing over itself like 30 someday. times. Yeah, I'll remember. I won't be forgetting either. Goodbye, Chapu. You always said I looked grumpy. But those were the happiest days of my life. So, uh, Yuna? I've decided. So, like, uh, oh, I can't remember. Can those really? speak those things uh, actually talk good? or they just float there? I remember. They just when I was only seven years old in Bevel that day, my father had defeated Sin, and the whole town was out in the streets. 
Everyone was laughing. They all seemed so happy. If I defeated Sin, that would make everyone happy, wouldn't it? I must do what everyone wants, not just what I want. Let's go back. You gotta tell Seymour. Before that, call Sir Jet. Give it a try. Huh? Don't worry. He won't come. Trying not to think about my old man made me think about him, of course. See, told you. He isn't here because he's not dead. He's Sin. <laughs> that means he's alive, you know. What if my old man really is Sin? What would I say to Yuna? Heck, uh, to everybody in Spira. Wait, why should I have to apologize for him anyway? I'd rather never see him again. What makes you hate him so? Everything he does just makes me mad. It was his fault that me my and my dad's mother... too cool. Uh, uh, hey, thanks about well, Jack. Suddenly there's a fucking space it, whale there. It's her. She's very pretty. But, wait, no one ever performed the sending for her. She must have accepted death while she was still alive. Whoa there, uh, that's my mother you're talking about. Oh, I I'm sorry. Hmm, it's okay. Uh, I think I just figured something out. What? Why I hate my old man. See, See, so, so I, told I told him what I thought of him right, right there. What? Oh, good, really? with daddy issues. Of course. <laughs> I suppose, but... Mommy! Just, Just a, sec, a sec, dear. Whenever my old man was around, my mother wouldn't even look at me. Maybe that's when I started to resent him, even hate him. When he left us, Mom just lost her energy. Is she all right? Why should you care? If she dies, I wouldn't know what to do. Don't say Mom is gonna die. I apologize. The old lady next door told me, when a lovebird dies, the one left behind, it just gives up living so it can join its mate. It was just like that. I hated my old man even more. But really, my old man... Mommy! Just, just a sec, sec dear. dear. I go to him. You'll cry if you don't. Oh, man. Hmm? I must sound so stupid. I don't think so. How embarrassing. Well, need some more time. No, I'm ready. Did I miss something? <laughs> Thanks for waiting. I'll go give my answer to Maester Seymour. <gasps> Lord Jiska! Oh, Lord Jiska! Uh, he does not belong here. Why? Yuna, send him. Lord Jiska! He is Lord Jiska no more. Send him now. <sighs> Talk later. We leave now. Uh, what was that just now? That really Lord Disco? 
don't understand how a man like Lord Jiskel can die and not be sent. I would think that he was sent once. But he stayed on Spira. Something, a powerful emotion, could have bound him to this world. Such things happen. That's against the rules, isn't it? It means he died an unclean death. Okay, so let's find the safe sphere. We'll let shit pop off next time. Yeah. Alright, so thank you everyone for showing up. Um, there may or may not be a stream tomorrow, we don't know. Who knows? It Nobody is a mystery. Alright, so later everybody. Bye. Bye. Good night.